learned a lesson from this one. Hi guys, uh, for today's video, meron akong almost na siya overripe na bananas, but it's still good. It's very sweet. So ayo ko siyang kainin cuz it might add up sh more sugar to my body and it's not good for the baby. So I'm controlling my sugar intake. So I'm going to make moist banana chocolate cake with this one. Hope it will turn out good. Um, hindi ako gagamit ng white sugar because I want to eat it as well. <laughs> Just a little bit maybe. I will try to use stevia. So, sana okay yung taste, matamis, and probably I will add also less salt. We'll see. We'll start with the flour. Let's sift it first. It's better to sift them twice to be sure. We'll now add baking soda and sift it as well. baking powder salt one teaspoon of stevia adding half and let's mix these ingredients together i almost forgot the cocoa powder the cocoa powder only contains uh, 10 to 12 percent of fat wow here in poland when you buy cocoa powder or any other powder like milk powder they will indicate the percentage of fat contents in it so mas maganda siya di ba so let's mix all the dry ingredients now fast forward muna natin Ayan. So it should be okay now. So I hope I didn't forget any mixture or ingredients in this dry mixture. So now let's prepare our wet ingredients. Adding bananas and I will be using a potato masher to mash them. Fast forward muna. Now the banana is ready. For egg, I will not use real egg, but I will use egg substitute. This is um, ground flaxseed. And I will use this as a egg substitute. It's four tablespoons of ground flaxseed and I will add 12 uh, tablespoons of hot water. It now has uh, 11 tablespoons of hot water. Let's stir first to see its consistency. And let's add the last tablespoon of what hot water. And then we'll stir it. And it now starts to thicken. So we'll have to set it aside for the time being until it will thicken more. Now back to our banana mixture, we are going to add the rest of the wet ingredients. Now we are adding a 200 ml of oil and I'm using olive oil. Our egg replacer has thickened more so we are now going to add it. And mix all the wet ingredients together. Now it's ready. We are now adding our dry ingredients to the wet ingredients.
and let's mix it by folding okay fast forward muna natin It actually smells good and I feel like I'm going to eat everything, all of it. So my mommy, yeah. if I really did, I'm afraid that my baby will grow so much. Oh my word. Now I'm going to add boiling water to the mixture. It will even smell really good. No, I can smell it. It's yummy. Uh, I'm going to stir it now, but not so much, so I will not over stir it. I tasted the mixture and it's salty a bit, so I added three spoons, a teaspoons of stevia sugar and now it's fine but i already over stir it so i don't know what's the result what the result will be so sige lang it's okay as long as i achieve the taste so it's a lesson for me this time the oven is now ready i'm putting olive oil and preparing the pan if in any case the mixture will not be enough in this pan, I prepared another loaf pan. But I'm hoping that everything will fit in here. All the ingredients to this um, moist banana chocolate cakes will be in the description below. And if you want to do it, you can follow it, of course. And if you want to be vegan or if you have a high sugar and if you want to lower it, you can follow also the instruction. But just be sure that you don't over mix it like I do. Of course, it's my experiment though, but I learned from it. I have learned from it. So we're putting it now in the oven. Its temperature is at 180 degrees Celsius. And we're going to bake it for 40 minutes. Ito na yung moist banana chocolate cake na ginawa ko. Obviously, nag-flatten down siya. Over, over, uh, na over, ano ko siya, stir. So, but the most important for me now is the taste. Kung sakto yung taste o hindi. Kung matamis ba siya or lumabas ba yung asin o hindi. So, we'll find it out. Here we go. I learned a lesson from this one. So when using stevia, moist siya sa ilalim guys, actually. Mm. Sakto lang yung tamis niya. Next time I will try no salt. My kid is back. So it's my husband. Hodge and Jello, let's eat. Taste this with me. This is moist chocolate, uh, banana chocolate cake. Thank you everyone for joining me and for watching. Let's see you again next time.